Video number 116, find the focus, directrix, and vertex for each parabola. x squared equals negative 12y. Well, what we're learning here in this chapter is that you can have what's referred to as, well, I'm going to call it focus directrix form. Here's the two standard forms for a parabola that are in what are called focus directrix form. And here's how this works. Basically, the p-value is going to tell us how far away the focus is from the fixed line. Now, they're giving us a new definition for a parabola. They're saying that a parabola is the set of points, okay, that are equidistant to a fixed point and a fixed line. Here's the new definition for parabola. A set of points that are equidistant to a fixed point and a fixed line. So what you'll have here is this. There's a fixed point, there's a fixed line. This point here is the same distance away from the fixed point as it is to the fixed line. This one point is. Now it says it's a set of points. That's what a parabola is. It's a, a parabola is a set of points that is uh, equidistant to the fixed point called the focus and the fixed line called the directrix. All right. Now, so back to this drawing here. If you went north a little bit, let's say point B, wouldn't you say point B is further away from the focus as it is to the directrix? Of course. So in order to go north, you'd have to go north and west. See that? You'd have to go this way. Now we're talking about congruent. Like that. And I think you guys can probably see here that you would end up with this type of shape. Same thing. If you went directly south, this is obviously closer to the fixed line as this is to the focus. So as you go south, you'd have to go west. So this, these, are, these points here are equidistant to the fixed point as they are to the fixed line, if I've drawn it correctly. All right, now, the p-value allows us to find that focus, okay? So, uh, p is, the directed, is called the directed distance from the vertex to the focus of the parabola. All right, so what we do is this. We, the argument is that negative 12 is in the 4p position. It would actually be this equation here. So therefore, negative 12 equals 4p. Therefore, p is negative 3. This means the parabola is going to face either south or west. It's because the p value is negative. Now, it says also since there's no values being added or subtracted from x and y, the vertex is 0, 0. Okay, so therefore the vertex is 0. You can clearly see that when x is 0, y is 0. All right? This graph goes down, therefore the focus is 3 below the vertex at 0, negative 3. Now, why does it go down rather than west? Because of what we already understand from studying parabolas in Algebra 1. This is a north-south parabola. It's going to actually open north. Vertex. The one that says x equals y squared... That's an east-west parabola. In fact, it's going to go directly east as long as this is a positive in front of here. All right? If it was a negative, it would go back this way. Okay? Now, P is 3, excuse me, negative 3, so the directrix is at y equals 3. The focus is at 0, negative 3. So what you would have here is you would have uh, vertex 0, 0, focus 0, negative 3, Directrix y equals 3. If we put a 3 here, negative 3 there. And there you go. go. The parabola goes downward. Bam! Find the focus, directrix, and vertex, and axis of symmetry. And eh, we're not going to do that for each parabola. Okay. What you do here is this we decide what shape this parabola is. Okay. And this shape is definitely what? a y squared shape. So it's going to be an east-west parabola. Okay? So therefore the vertex is at negative 3 comma 4. 
What you do is you zero out the squared by putting a 4 for y. Zero out the squared would give you a negative 3 for x. In order to make this zero, x would have to be negative 3 as long as 4 was. 4 was y, that gives you a zero to the left. x negative 3 gives you a zero on the right, so therefore this is the vertex. All right. Then let's find, it says let's find p by letting 5 8 be in the 4p position. Then divide by 4, bam, 5 30 seconds is P. That's a positive value, so we're going to go east. All right, and the X isn't squared. Okay, the focus is going to be 5 30 seconds to the right of the vertex at negative 3 plus 5 30 seconds, comma 4. The directions is going to be to the left, right, because it's definitely an east parabola. So it's going to be at uh, X equals negative 2 and 27 30 seconds. All right, so good times, and talk to you later.